Ahoy hoy YouTube modeling community. It's the Lazy Eyed Modeler in the Witty Workshop. This is an update on the United Scale Automotive Content Creators 1944 build. Um, I entered this late in the going and um, so I decided to build this Morgan Automotive Detail 1944 Woody as my entry into the group build. Um, as I said, I uh, started late with this, and uh, if you saw the previous video on this subject, I had uh, three of the uh, resin kits, two from uh, Morgan Automotive Detail and one, the original one, from All American Models. Um, I was going to go with one body and then decided since I'm not building it stock, and that's my passion is to build one of these completely stock uh, down the line so I took the uh, roughest body to build and as a result uh, it's taken a little more work and I um, I guess I would have to say I slacked off I'm I'm uh, was nervous about doing the necessary uh, work to get the fit better than what it was straight out of this box and that means working uh, if you're working with resin you either have to use epoxy or super glue or something like that you can't use normal model glue to put a uh, resin kit together and so I had to <clears throat> get over my fear of that to start building this so that kind of slowed me up a bit um, and uh, part of the problem right now today is the due date for this project it's January 15th uh, 2022 and right now the temperature outside is about minus 21 22 which is about a minus 11 and this morning it was minus 15 Fahrenheit now it's about minus 11 Fahrenheit so to do any painting right now is very difficult because I don't want to put on the uh, fume extractor because it just sucks all the heat right out of the out of the room and we've had this for a couple days now but I will show you where we are and I'm hoping to complete this build a week late by January 23rd 2022 um, I'm hoping we've got about a couple more days that are uh, going to warm up and then it gets cold and then another warm day so I'm going to have to pick my painting times with this but um, let's look at what we've done so far uh, we'll just pan up a bit there the seats that's the first sort of prime coat of tan on the seats the um, can of Tamiya that I was using did not spray well so I'm going to have to sand them down a bit and trying to even out the uh, the coloring before I do any more detailing to them. Over here we have the chassis. It has a base coat of red oxide primer and then it, originally I wanted to use lacquers on it but because of the cold and the, trying not to use the uh, fume extractor um, I um, used acrylics instead and there is various colors of um, rust colors over top the red oxide primer and then it's sort of uh, covered with flat black paint because even if it would have been semi-gloss back when it was a new vehicle we're doing an older vehicle that's been around a while now I still have to mask off and paint the exhaust system in an appropriate metallic color and then it should be good to go and we can start painting up the uh, rest of the suspension and the engine and whatnot um, and then here is the body and there's the chaos of my desk <laughs> here's the body um, below the tape is where I've added a plastic strip to the bottom of the body so it feels better at the bottom and it comes closer to the running boards than it did originally and there's some filling in on the back edge where there was gapping and it's the same <clears throat> on this side uh, the reason it's taped up is I have to put some uh, body filler putty in there just to help smooth things out 
and we've uh, filled in the two openings that the whole um, hood hinges would normally go in so I just have to finish the body work there and I also want to drill a couple holes to put magnets in to keep the hood on help keep the hood in place um, so if I can start painting tomorrow uh, it's uh, certainly some masking involved here but I think we can still pull it off and have it done in a week assuming we can uh, you know have two or three days out of out of this without the arctic temperatures anyway I apologize to the rest of the uh, people in the uh, USAC the United Scale Automotive Content Creators I haven't been able to get this finished quite in time I'm hoping uh, you don't mind if I extend it a week and see how far we can get with that I really want to try to get it done as close as we can to the the due date so we'll leave it here for now and uh, we'll talk to you hopefully in a week unless I get up some neat updates for you okay take care bye bye now